Lord, we really thank you for such a glorious day, for a magnificent occasion. And uh, Father, we just pray that you would bless the proceedings today and all that you see fit to do as you bring this couple together under your presence and under your authority. In your name we pray. Amen. On this beautiful day, 27th of March 2021, I commit to being your first helper to bring out the very best in you, to love, honour, support your dreams and encourage you always and to have you as a priority just slightly above the horses. <laughs> in making these promises, I want to make you laugh every day, share the hope for our future and truly feel blessed with what we have and what is yet to come. Matt, I can't wait to live out a year's growing old and grey on our beautiful property in Cromer with our amazing children. On this amazing afternoon, I commit to making your dreams become my dreams. To love you and honour you and to show you every day that I know exactly how lucky I am to have you in my life. In making these promises, I want to make you smile every day, keep our lives exciting, adventurous and full of passion. I promise when the dishes need cleaning or the washing is to be hung up, I'll conveniently disappear to a paddock to check on your horses. Lisa, I can't wait to continue this journey we've started, growing together with our beautiful children, striving to make our dreams a reality. Have given their vows to one another, personally and legally, they have exchange rings which fulfills the perfect circle of the duty of love that makes you one in heart and in spirit and under the legality of our nation. You're now able to, uh, what are we going to do here now mate? What's the, what's the, what's the occasion? So without further ado, it is now my pleasure to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Parkin.
One of the proudest moments for a father is walking his daughter down the aisle. Today I had that privilege. <laughs> uh, Lisa, known as Princess from a very early age, <laughs> can be sweet, charming and impetuous like a princess. <laughs> Highly motivated and self-driven, and always a higher achiever. There was, however, one significant event that changed our world forever. Dad, can I please have a horse? <laughs> and nobody says no to Lisa, and so we had horses. <laughs> The one with one eye, I think it used to go around in circles. Uh, the fast ones, the slow ones. Uh, one was so good it had to be shot with a tranquilizer gun just so you could load it up. <laughs> I think there'll always be horses, Lisa. It's just a very short speech. Hi everyone, my name is Sandy Park and proud mother of the groom. On behalf of my family, friends here today, I would like to congratulate Lisa and Matthew on their very special day that they've been anxiously waiting for. And we are very much welcome, Lisa and Helena, into our extended family. We have also really enjoyed being welcomed into Lisa's family and look forward to many more get-togethers and meeting more of her family. Thank you all for helping them to celebrate today. So I'm Matt's brother-in-law. Um, I've been his sole brother-in-law for the past 21 years, but that's obviously changed today. So there's now five of us. What do you call a group of brother-in-laws? Pain in the ass, maybe? Um, so we're going to be around to give Matt lots of advice whether he wants it or not in the future. Oh, I just want to say to you boys, it's awesome that you could stand up beside your dad today. Um, you're probably not going to realise how important it, it is until much later in life, but I know that he's really proud of you boys and you've done a great job for your dad. So can we all give these guys a round of applause? Uh, can we have a toast to the bridesmaids? Yeah. And the flower girls. Cheers. Great work. To Lisa, I want to welcome you into our little family. I know we're not as big as the Bates family because you guys are huge. Um, but um, you've come in, you and Helena have come into our lives and, and the ease with which you've become an important member of our family is, is really uh, indicative of your character. You've got a good heart and you're a lovely person. So I know that Nikki and I and the boys, my mum, Sandy, we love having you as part of our family. So welcome. Um, and also I want to thank you for everything that you've done with this bloke. Stand up, Maddie. I've spoken to a lot of people tonight, and this was in my speech, but everyone said the same thing. There's a glint in your eye. You're happier. You're smiling. You're, you're the Maddie that I knew when I met you. you. You are relaxed, you're awesome, you're an awesome person, and you're loving life, and that's the best thing, and that's because of you, Lisa. Your dad's not here, right? It's sad that your dad's not here, but I know that when I used to sit with your dad a lot and chat with him, I know that he was really happy that Lisa came into your life and he was really wrapped about it. And I know Lisa, he's really happy that you're around and um, he'd be really proud of you today. Um, and I know that he's not here with us in body, but I know with the love in the room that he's certainly here in spirit. And I can see him right now looking at you, smiling on his face, thinking, thank God Matt's got his shit together. <laughs> he would be saying that, wouldn't he? So me and Pargo have been pretty great mates for a long time. We've been through some shit stuff. Right? And I'm not going to dwell on that because that was crap. But some of the funny stuff has been hilarious. So anyway, Pargo and I were walking over from the pub one night. It was New Year's Eve. We'd had a couple. I dragged him off of the bar. He was trying to dodge the fan. He was trying to hit him in the head. He couldn't work it out. We'd walked up to Tim's to try and work out how we were going to stay at Tim's at night. Couldn't find a key, couldn't work anything out. So we thought it'd be best to walk back to my place. Now, I don't know whether you've done the geographics of where I live compared to where the pub is at Mount Pleasant, but it's about four k's as the dirt road goes. We're in thongs. <laughs> <laughs> I got a little emotional. <laughs> Seven k's in. <laughs> snaking it up the road, a bit wobbly. And I'd come to the conclusion that that was it. I'm done. I'm going to go toes up, mount. 
Pargo, talk me through it, coach me all the way home. Fornication. Uh, um, <coughs> for an occasion, may you be as rich in life as you are in love. Have a wonderful wedding day. May your marriage be filled with all the right ingredients, a heap of love, a dash of humour, Lisa, that's you, a whole heap of romance, a spoonful of understanding. May your joy last forever. Congratulations. I'm so happy you have found Matt who shares the same values, country life, community spirit and easygoing nature you do. Now, instead of a character from 27 Dresses, you have become the Brady Bunch. <laughs> <laughs> Buying a house in Cromer to create and share a loving home with Lockie, Jamison and Helena. It was an honour to stand by your side today. I wish you all a lifetime of love and uh -huh. happiness together. <laughs> um, on behalf of my wife and I, I'd like to thank everyone for coming. Um, <laughs> Thank you to the, uh, uh, the bridesmaids for looking after Lisa last night. Um, I've no doubt she was very much looking forward to uh, the events of last night and hanging with the five of you as, as, as a crew, um, which, was, which was lovely. To the Bates family, um, I, look, I can't thank you enough. You guys have been exceptional. Um, you've accepted me in uh, as part of the family without question. Stu and Gail, you've been amazing. Um, genuinely, um, oh, I, I couldn't be happier. Uh, for those family of mine that aren't here, um, my old man uh, passed away eight months ago and that was a huge hit. Um, Luigi uh, as well, um, a big impact on our small family. Um, there's not many of us and um, we're a pretty tight bunch. Um, Mum, you've been exceptional. My, my mum's amazing, she's top shelf. Nikki and Max, uh, the boys, um, wow. And then to my two, I couldn't be prouder. Um, they were exceptional today, they looked amazing. Um, couldn't be proud. And I am beyond words in, in terms of how happy I am and how much I am in love with you. Um, you know, we've come a long way from that blue dress uh, to, uh, to, to my lovely wife and our future. Oh, thank you. Cheers, cheers. Thanks, everybody. Thank you. Rainy days don't seem so wet Stormy nights don't stay From the moment that we met You're worth the wait Oh, this could be the best thing that I'll ever know Talked for hours and never slept Two silhouettes on the concrete steps We watched the sun as it slowly crept From the horizon to the place we met Oh, this could be the best thing that I'll ever know
congratulations Lisa and Matthew, have a great life together. Hey Lisa and Paco, uh, Frog has just arrived so we're going to oh. catch him up on the goss. Yeah. But we just want to say blessings upon your marriage, what an amazing ceremony, what an amazing start to marriage. And we're so happy for you. I'm glad that Parker's finally got a second in love to Frogger. Frogger a second in love to me. It's a man thing. Don't know it's much about crush. it. Pretty much. Uh, but from the Lekker mob, we just want to say thank you. Um, and uh, including us in your lives. But we're just really blessed to have you in ours. And blessings on your marriage. And on behalf of the uh, Bird Football Club, I'd just like to let you know, Lisa, that the AGM will be in November. <laughs> and uh, whatever you want to get on board, get on board. Go Rooster! I don't think I've got anything to add, so happy, happy wedding and all of that stuff. So great to be here. Yay! Congratulations, Lisa and Matthew. Congrats. Still disappointed there's no horse rides. Oh, <laughs> so you want Congratulations, a horse. guys. Congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations, Lisa and Matt. We're very excited and happy for you. Cheers, guys. We love you. Hey, look, take it on your chin, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Have a great night. Congratulations. Congratulations. Marco, Lisa, Batesy. Have a bloody great wedding. We've had a ball so far. We've got to say, lots of bloody photos. I don't know, what else? Anybody else going to do? Done well, mate. All the best in future life. And, uh, our best wishes as the boys crew. Yep. And here's to Mr. and Mrs. Bates. Well done. All right, ladies, I just want to say congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations. Woo. Woo. Both having the best day. Love you. Love and you. thank you for this, yeah. this, 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 this. We're so happy for the both of you. and wish you the well. Yeah.